And we are set for a women's final that we have been anticipating wildly. DC Scandal has been the number one team in the nation all year long. And we thought we might see Scandal and Fury, the perennial champ of the women's division. But Brute Squad had other ideas, taking down Fury in the semifinals. And Brute Squad and Scandal now meet for the 2023 championship. Tulsa Deg Douglas catching the pull and immediately centering the disc to Kate Bosey. And Bosey with a stall count rising, shoots it deep and is brought in by Tornquist, who connects with Hecht. Fruit Squad has been in the finals seven of the last eight seasons. They've won three titles in that span. High stall count, Huck for Scandal. In the deep space, Hannah Boone could not bring it in. And Volchek quickly pounces on the turnover and gives it right back. One of the things I like about Scandal is when there's a turn, they immediately start either playing offense or defense, really not giving a lot of other teams breathing room. Brute Squad known for a similar style. Zoo sending Volchek. And she's got it, and she is ruled in the end zone, and it's a score. Lisa Dang conversing with Caroline Tornquist. Back to Walker. And zoom, zoom. Maybe Lizzie's turn in 2023. And Scandal has a chance to tie this thing back up. Lori just not someone who's going to be intimidated by this moment either. A lot of big games in her career. Wallace looking for Murphy. <laughs> Two all. Root squad was a mediocre five and six on the season. Since that loss, they've won 13 of 14 games. And they have a chance to avenge that one loss from Thursday in pool play right here, right now. Heck sees Douglas wide open deep. Tulsa sneaking into the deep space. Lily's probably like, remember what happened in that USA Germany game last summer? That's probably not what she's talking about right now, but she could be. High stall shot. Stall, I think, was called. Claire Trope makes the catch, and we do have a stall call behind the play. Scandal continues, and they think they've scored. Okay, um, my ruling, it was not a stall. So it'll be here on one. Observer making a ruling and we get back in action. Kat Ritzman on the goal line and it's dropped by Walker. Difficult connection there. Off the hands of Zhu, but she catches it on the second effort. There was a lot of contact. It's also Sevier shaken up. Yeah. Hopefully Blaise Sevier is okay. What a player she has been this season. Sophie Knowles, lefty backhand for Zoo, keeps it going for Samia Ismail, who sends it deep. Trout, uh, Trope versus Volchek, and out the back. Good poach block. Around for Zoo. Ismail breaks the mark, but Cami Groom was ready for it. Intense defense right there on the end zone line. High flying attempt there from Scandal, but Brute Squad is going to get this disc back. Another turnover in the red zone as Troutman throws it right to the defense and the huck goes up, Trope and Volchek again. This time, Claire elevates, sends it for Cami Groom! And Scandal scores the equalizer. All righty, Brute back on offense and Tulsa Douglas sending it deep. Yuga Zhao is there. What a shot from Tulsa. I think that the break chances and the conversion rate is probably going to be the story of this final. Both teams having struggled to convert 
in past games. And shooting it, Troutman chasing Trope. It's a brilliant read and an excellent throw. And we're tied at four. Of course, Leanne Hoffman's been a big part of this Brute Squad run. She's in her ninth year on Brute. As the Huck goes up, Malinowski and Erickson, and it's Erickson who gets highest for the block. Yeah, that's not a matchup I would want to see every single day at practice. A lot of float on it from Murphy. And flying in for the block, Caroline Tornquist never gave up on the disc. Farrero to the end zone for the score. It's bookends for Tornquist. Volchek now poaching into the lane. And Ismail gets the block. Scandal never really looked like they knew what their opponent was doing defensively, but Angela Zhu giving it right back. Ooh, some, so a lot of stoppages on this picks, particularly meaning players are too close together. Boone versus Ismail. Hannah Boone. Delivers. Tried to squeeze it through the tight space, getting a little bit impatient and turning it over. Cammy Groom loops it long into a crowd. Tornquist making the cut, denied by some good scandal defense. Hoffman with a great double move on Buke. Gets it back for Douglas. Swings it to the open space, and Zhao is there. It says a lot about Hannah Boone that Brute Squad has put Lev Kowalczyk on her. And an errant reset intercepted by Zhu. Volchek airs it out. Tornquist is there. Perfect throw that we are good enough to win the national championship. It's, it's not enough to believe it or to think it. You need to know it. Sadler, a, a mainstay on so many great teams in the women's division year in, year out. Here's Trope on the goal line. And Cammy Groom is open. To Zoo. Up the line, Angela can't get it. Do have Sandy Jorgensen in that deep space if they need her to bail them out, but it's really a back and forth. Can hear the crowd yelling dangerous play. My hand touched the disc and you hit my hand. Of the contact I'm remembering, it felt like the disc was passed already. My ruling is no foul. Have that right to the space first. Absolutely, I think the thing we talk about less often is the responsibility of the thrower not to put your teammates into dangerous spaces. Ismail was not looking for Zhu when it left her hands, but it works out as Brute Squad takes half, 8-6. Boston crossing her over. And the huck goes up from Walker. Intended for Trope, but Caitlin Lee elevates for the D. Lee and Hoffman. Gigi Downey's deep downfield with Becky Malinowski. Nice job to squeeze it through. Hoffman gets it to Volchek. Shooting it for Malinowski. What a shot. Ritzman keeps it moving. And Laurie launching for Trope into double coverage again. Ashley Buke is the trailer, and it's off her fingertips. Boston has the disc again, and this would really be a gut punch to Scandal if they can conserve. Low bullet for Groom. Trope. Low reset. Dang handles it. Ritzman up the line, and Claire Trope scores again. But Zeus still able to get it. To the continue, and now Volchek coming under and letting it rip. Ospina against Boone, and Boone wins the battle. Amy Joe, of course, played for Scandal 2016 to 2019. Always a lot of crossover between teams. Boone shooting it. Groom got it. Cammy's fired up. Scandal breaks.
Zhao, high release lefty backhand for Ferrero. Sending Douglas over Trope, and Douglas gets there. Beautiful vision. Zoe Heck scores. Coming underneath, and it was a contested catch. Trope shaken up and calls the foul on Troutman. I was coming here, and I think the contact both in the head as I was trying to catch and on the arm, um, I think it was like, I don't think it caught it. I think it hit me in the hand, and then I got pushed down onto the ground. And I think that we both went in our line trying to attack the space in between of us, and like that's how the contact happened, and not that I pushed you from behind, and that's why I'm going for a foul contest. Observer ruling, it was offsetting fouls, so the result of the play stands, so it will be a turnover. I mean, I understand Troutman's case in her pursuit of the disc. Ismail sending it long. It's a crowd brewing, and it's smacked down. Scandal back in action very quickly again. Hand blocked on the mark. Are you kidding me? Lily Troutman. To the break side for Troutman. Ismail. Levka to the end zone, and the German duo delivers again for Brute Squad. Shifts in point leads, but also shifts in emotional momentum. Oh, that was a hard landing for Murphy, but she does not call a foul, and play will continue. The tough call went against Claire Trope, and Brute Squad capitalizes again and leads by four here in the finals. If DC's going to do it, it's got to be go time, Katie. Absolutely. We have just under a half hour left. To score three more times. Ismail, nice throw for Zhu. Samia. One of the backhand hits Troutman. Volchek makes a move, gets open again. How does she make it look so easy? Yeah, you can see players floating into space, playing more poachy, a junk look, trying to throw Scandal off of their game again. Ashley Buke thought she had it, I did too. We actually disagreed on what we saw, so we're going to leave it as a contest. It'll have to go back. Wallace just trying to force it to trope, and it works. Straddling the end zone. Quick reset to Walker. And a pick halts play. That snaps the scandal. Stretch where they've been outscored 4-0. Ball check sending Zoo. Again, Brute Squad makes it look easy. Lizzie Laurie just got point blocked by Caroline Tornquist. Finds himself on the doorstep of more glory, but Hoffman turns it over. And Scandal's not dead just yet. Angela Zhu rips it back to the end zone for Troutman. She's got it, but hang on. The observers are waving their arms in the air, and the celebration needs to be put on hold for at least a moment. Okay, foul, no contest. The disc is going to stay in 17. Zhu picks up, releases immediately. Troutman just shy of the goal line. Back for Sue, and she's in, and it's over. And Boston Brute Squad are champions again. What a performance. They close the game on a 6-1 run.